Hello, I am Stuart. Here in the video we will share the details for the Rainbow Six Siege Error Code 00x00000001. As per our research, this error appears mid-loading when players try to start Rainbow Six Siege. Once the error comes, the game forces players into offline mode and displays a message stating that an update is required, but the update itself does not appear. According to our research, this error mainly comes because of some issues with the game's files, or if your security program interferes with the game. First, before trying anything, restart your device and check if the game needs to be updated. If there is a pending update, install it and check for the error again. The first thing we suggest is deleting the BattleEye folder from the Rainbow Six Siege game files. After that, Verify the game files on Steam. This should force reinstall BattleEye properly and may fix the error. If the error still comes, turn off your real-time antivirus and firewall before launching the game. Several users have reported that simply disabling Windows Defender real-time protection resolved the issue. If this resolves the issue, then you may need to add Rainbow Six Siege to your antivirus exception list. Another workaround is to run the game files with compatibility settings. Start the game, let the error message pop up, and then follow these steps. Open the Rainbow Six Siege main directory. Locate the Rainbow Six underscore B file, right-click, go to Properties, then select the Compatibility tab. Set it to run in Windows 8 compatibility mode and run as administrator. Do the same with the Rainbow Six underscore DX11 file. After making these changes, restart the game and check if the error persists. If you are still stuck with the error, try disabling your Ubisoft two-step verification and then re-enabling it. After that, restart Ubisoft Connect and try launching the game again. If the error still persists, try running Ubisoft Connect as an administrator before launching the game. To do this, right-click the Ubisoft Connect.exe file, select Run as Administrator. You can also go to Properties, then the Compatibility tab, and check the box to Always Run as Administrator. If this doesn't work, try doing the same for the game's .x file in the installation folder. If none of these solutions work, the issue might be due to an outage. Go to the ubisoft.com slash n dash us slash game slash rainbow dash six slash siege slash status to see if Rainbow Six Siege servers are down. If the issue is server related, you'll need to wait until Ubisoft resolves it. At last, if the error still continues after trying everything, Report the issue to Ubisoft support. Thanks for watching. If this video helped, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Have any questions or issues? Drop them in the comments below. See you in the next one.